Hello guys, welcome, and today I'm gonna show you how to make a track like Dimitri Vegas and like Mike. So, if you're not subscribed to the channel, click that subscribe button to see more content, and drop a big thumbs up, and let's get into the video. Set the tempo to 128 BPM, and add some claps. Then add some plucks. I added an EQ to cut some lows, and another one to create a low pass automation. Now, add some pads. I added a camel crusher to create some distortion, and an EQ to cut some lows. Create a crunchy bass line. I cut off some highs, and a fruity balance to create a volume automation, and some stereo separation. Add some risers and down filters to create a small transition. Here's how our intro sounds like. Now let's start the build up. Add a simple snare build up. Add some percussion and some drums to create a fill. And some risers and down filters. Don't forget to add the drop leads with a low pass filter. Here's how the finished build up sounds like. Now let's start the drop. Start by adding a kick and a clap and some rides at the second part of the drop add some toms like this drop leads consist of three different sounds here's the first one I added some side chain and some EQ to cut some lows. Here's the second one. I side chained it and cut off some lows. Here's how the third one sounds like. I side chained it and cut off some lows and highs. For the bus channel, I added some OTT, and some EQ to create a low pass automation. Here's how they sound together. Drop bass consists of two sounds. Here's the first one. I added some side chain, and some blood overdrive. Here's the second one. I added some side chain, and cut off some lows. For the bus channel, I added some OTT, and some reverb. Here's how they sound together. Add that sub bass. For the processing, I added some side chain and some EQ to cut off the highs and boost it to lows. Add a crunchy bass line.
I added some side chain, and some stereo separation. Add some warm pads. I side chained it, added some EQ, some reverb, and some saturation. At the second part of the drop, add some bells. I just side chained it, and added a fruity balance to create a volume automation. Add some drums and effects to create some fills. Add some risers and down filters. I added this crowd noise sound effect. And this stab to make it more interesting. And guys, our track is done. Subscribe to the channel if you are not, like this video if you enjoyed, it helps me a lot, and let's see our final result.